Have you ever been unfaithful in a committed relationship? Well, if so, then you are not alone. Because if you look at figures uh, for the UK, for example, there are estimations that 15% of men and 9% of women have overlapping sexual relationships in one year, according to the British uh, Attitudes and Lifestyle Survey. Well, I as a couple therapist and, and family therapist, I'm especially interested in the aftermath of infidelity. So, how do couples cope with infidelity once it's disclosed? And how do counselors and therapists work with couples where infidelity is, is an issue? We know that not, not all couples where infidelity has been an issue uh, separate. So those couples who go through uh, this coping process successfully, they go through different stages. It's kind of comparable to the stages people go through when they grieve or in a mourning process. And counselors and therapists, they can support this process by helping couples to making sense of what happened, to take responsibility for their actions and, most importantly, to work on underlying, underlying issues in their relationship. And interestingly, those couples who manage successfully to go through this process, they report afterwards that the quality of their relationship is much better than before the affair. Thank you.